Hello and welcome to story writing using pictures. Let's begin. As always, read the instructions carefully. That is the first thing to do. Let's read. Part four. You are writing a story about John's picnic with his parents. Look at the pictures and write the story in about 30 words. You may use the words in the boxes to help you. What happens in the end? Finish the story. Today, we will write more than 30 words. So, before beginning, think before you write. Use these questions to help you. Where and when? Where are they? At May Park. And when does the story happen? If you look at the pictures, you can see the sun shining. So that means it's the afternoon. Who can you see? I can see John, his dad, and his mom, or his parents. Later on, the monkey comes in. How do they feel? At the beginning, they are happy. But later on, they get angry. What happens in the story? If you look at picture one, birds are flying and they are having a picnic. In picture two, the monkey steals the food and they get quite scared. In the end, dad chases after the monkey. Finally, you have to decide how does the story finish? You can choose the ending. Please remember to write in present tense. For example, John takes a bite of his hot dog. That means it's happening now. If I write, John will bite his hot dog, that could be tomorrow. So that would be future tense. Remember your punctuation. The sentence, the monkey takes John's food. There is no capital letter at the beginning and no full stop. There is also not a capital letter for his name or an apostrophe showing that the food belongs to John. And finally, when someone speaks, you have to make sure you have your comma and you have your inverted commas. We will look at the writing in the next part.